Today, Kevin and I are going to try three brand new, uh, these are, it was B Up Protein Bars, and now they are calling themselves Yup, and uh, it's Yup Brands, and they have three new bars, they're B Jammin, and one of them has Apple Pie, and one of them is Vanilla Cherry Pie, and the other one is PB&J. So you notice they all say jammin' on the front. And uh, these were only $8.37, which is a really, really good deal because I bought them online. Shipping is always free. I love that. And they sent me a free bar in the mail. They sent me one of their free peanut butter bars. Now, I don't know if you've watched the other reviews we did. We weren't too crazy about these. That's okay. Um, Valerie is the one who told me about the Be Up Protein Bars, and then she told me about these new ones. She said, these are so good, you have to give them a try. So, um, and uh, once again, there's a personalized note. Kevin, thanks for your order. I hope you enjoy the bars. And then it's from the co-founder, which I can't quite read the name. So, um, I think that is so nice that they put a personalized note. They gave us a free bar. I mean, not a lot of companies will do that for you. So, what we're going to do is we're going to try these the same way that we did the Quest bars. Valerie said that these are really good heated up. So, we're going to half it, and we're going to try half unheated, and then we're going to heat the other half. And um, so, we're going to be stopping and starting the video a lot. You have to be careful with the package because Tanya can't take a picture of it without opening it. So I'm be very careful. And it's, and it's sticky. I mean, it's. I took a picture of. But see how it's stuck to the thing? It's very, very sticky. I, taking the picture sometimes uh, presents a challenge because I um, I took a picture of the front of all of them together, but then in order to get the back, it's kind of it goes around the side of the package. And uh, so you wouldn't really be able to see it very well. Correct. Right. First one now. So you can say what it is. Oh, the first one is apple pie a la mode. These are made with real fruit, carbs, protein, and fiber. There are 15 grams of carbs in here, 12 grams of sugar, 12 grams of protein, 13 grams of fiber. A low carb diet it is not. <laughs> a, uh, the whole bar is 150 calories. And it said something on these, I thought, let's see. I read something earlier. Oh, okay, it says, life is not about what you are, it's about what you dare to be. Challenged with taking a stand against nutritional ideals that don't apply to everyone, B. Jammin goes where no energy bar has gone before. Using real fruit carbs combined with protein, B. Jammin delivers energy, when you need it and simply tastes awesome. Dare to unlock your unlimited potential. It's time to be healthy. It's time to be better. But above all, it's time to be jamming. So, it's upside down. So, unheated. There you go. Oh, is this from the middle? Yeah. Did you show what it looked like in the middle? It looked like the same on the end. It's very, it sticks, like really bad. That's good though. Has a very strong apple flavor. Mm hmm. I like that. Texture is a little pasty, but the texture is a little strong. a little chewy. Yeah. But that has an excellent apple flavor. Like I said, they're, these are super sticky. I mean, not sticky like in like in syrupy sticky. It's more like just sticky like a like a bread dough would be sticky or a. You know, I like wonder that. if it's because they're so fresh. You know, know we got them straight sticky. from the the factory, so I wonder yeah. if it's because they're fresher. If you get them in the store, they might be hard as bricks. That could be. So we're gonna take this and heat it up in the microwave for a few seconds, and we'll be right back. Okay, how long did you I, heat it? I did it for five seconds. Okay. And it's still very sticky, but they're softer. Oh, that's very soft. No, it feels like you're biting into a piece of gum when you first get in your mouth. It definitely feels like a piece of chewing gum. Right, of course. That's good. I think heating it up took away a little bit of the flavor, but it's, it's good, good heated. But I like it better unheated. I like the texture better heated. I like the flavor better 
honey. <laughs> so if you were going to eat it, how would you eat it? If you were to buy one of these and I were to eat it, yeah. I would eat it unheated. I would eat it unheated too. Yeah. I just think that it has the most flavor that way. It's really good heated, but... They're very dense. These bars are very, very dense. Um, I can say that I do like these better than the, the other ones we tried. The other... <laughs> the other oh, bars. the B-Up bars, yeah. Yeah, the, the B-Up, uh, this, this is what he's talking about. There's that package too. And this one is the Vanilla Cherry Pie. Mm. And it is um, 160 calories. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and show what that one is because this will take me more. And time. this one is, I think this one has the most calories. This is the PB&J. And, well, of course, it's peanut butter and jelly. And it is 180 calories. So that has the most calories. But Now, this one's not as sticky. I'm wondering if this will be. I mean, it's a little sticky, but you can see it actually comes out of oh, the package. Oh, yeah, you didn't have to fight with that at And one, all. it's not stuck to the, to the right. See how the wrapper's still shiny? Let me show you the other one. Oh, yeah. This is the apple one. See all that stuff stuck to it? You can tell it literally got stuck. It's like they wrapped that one up when it was still warm and sticky. <laughs> okay. It was good, though. That apple pie was really good. I mean, that's not to say this one isn't sticky at all, but it isn't as bad as that one was. All right, so you, oh, let me show you. This is the cherry vanilla again. This smells really, really good. I know we're not trying this one yet, but it smells good. You can smell the peanut butter. But we're trying vanilla cherry. Okay. Grab your one. Um, you can kind of see the filling here. Wow, it's got a strong cherry flavor. Mm -hmm. I like that. I do too. I don't remember. Um, I like the flavor of it. I don't necessarily still don't like the texture of it, but. I don't remember the Quest Bars having a cherry. I don't either. They might have. I don't, I don't remember. That flavor wise, it's good. It's just, I'll, I'll sum it up my, what my feelings about the bar. But we're, we're going to heat this one up and try it out. Yeah. All right, five seconds again. Yeah. And it definitely um, has a softens it up. Gooey. I like that one better heated. I do too. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing that we feel the same way. Flavor wise, it's honestly the same. I think it's the same strength flavor wise, but the texture is so much softer. Mm -hmm. uh, it's almost like eating marshmallow fluff. Yeah, I was gonna say you put it in your mouth and it almost goes away. It <laughs> yeah. just—it's like you—you you haven't eaten anything. Okay, the last one, but that's really good, really good cherry vanilla flavor. This one might be better. This is the PB and J, and it's 180 calories. And you said this one didn't stick either. It did not stick at all to the paper. No trouble. Definitely smells like peanut butter. Um, there are 14 grams of carbs, 11 grams of sugar, 12 grams of protein, 11 grams of fiber. I kind of get us four pieces out of the middle. Yeah, so that you don't get end pieces. There's the inside. Definitely taste the peanut butter. But I got the jelly. I did too. What flavor jelly is it? Like a, it's, um, I didn't look at the It looks like yet. grape or something. I mean, it tastes kind of like a grape jelly. Mm -hmm. No, it's strawberry. It's got strawberry. Oh, jelly. yeah. I can buy that. Um, didn't taste like really strong stra fruit anyway. Um, it's strawberry filling. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, is there that or grape? One of the two. Which is completely different flavors, but... That just to me that just goes to show you how weak the flavor of the of the, the filling. It's weak enough to where you yeah, can't, can't really tell. Uh, yeah. My problem with that is the peanuts, the peanut butter tastes like peanut butter, but it tastes like a natural peanut butter, so it tastes like raw peanuts to me. I liked it though. I thought yeah. it was good. Yeah. I don't I like remember the, the, I like other, the other ones better. tasting this good. Are we gonna heat this one? Yeah, up? I'll heat this one up. I'll be back. Okay. Again, five seconds. That one didn't stick very much at all. That brought out that peanut butter flavor. That's good. 
That I, is good. I like that one better than he did. Yeah, I do too. Um, I could, I could go either way on that though. I, yeah, could, well, I like the texture. I could eat any of these just plain. Yeah. None of them have to be heated. You could eat them straight out of the package on the go to work. You or, could. Of course, they're sticky. The they're sticky. Some of them the stick one to the was package. Sticky. So. The apple. Uh, pie you, you have sticky. a hard time getting that one out on the road. Yeah, you would. <laughs> my, these are all excellent for me. I'll give you my opinion, then you can give yours. Yeah. Uh, they're all excellent. They have a great flavor. I enjoy these three times as much as the, the first ones. The my, regular V-Ups. The regular V-Up bars. My only worry, concern, would be that I wouldn't feel full. Because you do... Put them in your mouth, and just like with the cherry one, you put it in your mouth, and it's almost like, where did it go? Oh. It's gone, you know, because it's so soft. Um, and I, I would worry that I wouldn't feel as full, but we only had a small taste, and maybe if I ate a, a whole bar, I wouldn't feel that way. But they're um, really good. I like the flavor of all of them. Honestly, out of the, out of the, these are definitely 100 percent better than the B ups. I would not buy the peanut butter one again. That's just me. Um, I don't think it tasted enough like peanut butter and jelly. It kind of had a, an all-natural peanut peanut out of straight out of the shell with no salt. Or I mean, it was just it was just okay. Um, the cherry one was really good. I like that one the best, and the apple one would be the second one. Um, so your favorite's the cherry. I like the cherry the best. My the flavor was the really apple. strong. Uh, my only complaint about these bars for me is I'm comparing them against other bars. These are there's no substance to them. You know, there might be full of fiber and stuff like that, that you can't, you're not chewing it though, you know? That's pretty much what I was saying. Yeah, yeah. It, there's no substance to it. There's just a, you bite it, it's like chew it a couple of times, it's gone. Whereas um, like the Quest Bars and, well, because Quest Bars are similar, but they're a lot denser. Um, the peanut bars from, um, of course those aren't the same thing, but they're still. They're health bars. Yeah. The, the I nature, can only, he's talking about Nature, nature Valley, Valley and those aren't health bars. The only one I can really compare them to is the Quest the Bars. The Quest Bars. And the Quest Bars are just so much meatier. You know, there's so much more there to chew on, uh, or at least it seems that way. Because um, a lot of them have chunks of chocolate in it. The one we get is the S'mores. There's chunks of chocolate in it. You got something to actually bite into. It feels like a little crunch it's there dense. occasionally. Yeah. Um, you know, it's something to eat. Uh, these are something you would, like a piece of cream candy, you would <laughs> It is on, like you know. cream candy. Yeah. It is. So that's my only complaint. I don't necessarily have a problem with the flavors of these. Uh, by far better flavors than the mm -hmm. first ones were. Uh, something I would actually eat. But I would I would pass these up for the Quest Bars just because of the of the, the texture. If given the option of having both yeah. of them on the shelf. I would yeah. get the Quest. Right. But these are really good. They are good. I'm very glad we got to try them. So glad you told us about them, Valerie, because... Um, I would not have given them another shot if you hadn't have said these were so much better. So I um, hope you all enjoyed getting to see these out of the package and getting to see them heated up. And um, thanks for watching.